Eve Brownstone here with Brownstone Therapeutics. I'm here to interview Bill Morden, Rogers Park Chamber of Commerce President, about this past glorious weekend at the Artists of the Wall Festival. Tell us more about this past weekend, Bill. Well, it was a great Father's Day weekend with beautiful weather along our lakefront. We renamed Pret Beach to honor the late community activist Toby Prince, who saved our beaches and our parks from developers. We had a youth arts tent with hands-on activities guided by Jessica Correa and Christy Keenan of Mission Arts, Inc. We hosted our first ever photo show at Artists of the Wall to showcase the talented photographers of Rogers Park. We were able to raffle a Vivian Meyer frame print and raise over $1,000 to provide scholarships to park programs for local children. And we also had an impressive and eclectic lineup of local musical talent on both Saturday and Sunday booked and organized by Rogers Park vocalist Lucy Smith. It was artist galore, great music, and a beach dedication. Can you tell me a little bit about the Artists of the Wall Festival? Well, a lot's been said about its history, so I'll, I'll keep this part short. It, it was an annual celebration of community and creativity, coordinated by members of the Loyola Park Advisory Council and staffed by many volunteers, our festival brings neighbors of all ages together to paint the 600 foot long seawall at Loyola Park Beach in Rogers Park. What about the artist competition? Well, each year there's a new theme of Artists and Wall um, to inspire uh, our artists, young and old, to create their masterpiece on one of 154 spaces um, that when combined um, is 500, I'm sorry, 5,000 square foot mural each year. This year's theme was Dreaming It Real. There's a painting competition which includes three categories, uh, including adults, teens, and juniors. Uh, the winners this year for adults, first place, was square number 35 and 36, Jennifer Chase. Second place was square number four, Wendy Lauder. Third place, square number 13, William Macbeth family. Under the teen category, first place were squares 73 and 74, Miriam Vasquez and Kil Kilmer Elementary School. Second place was square number 45, Miriam Baskin. And for the junior category, First place was square number 65, Luella Welch. And second place was square number 24, Isabel Salazar. Very nice. What if, uh, what are, are there more events happening at Loyola Park this summer? Well, in addition to the Artists of the Wall Festival, there are many other summer events at Loyola Park. Uh, we have a free movie in the park coming Saturday, July 19th at dusk, uh, Captain Phillips. Uh, Shakespeare in the Park, a, a Midsummer Night's Dream, two free performances, Friday and Saturday, July 25th and 26th at 6.30 p.m. And this year we're hosting the Chicago Latino Film Festival, Esther Somewhere, Wednesday, August 6th at dusk. All events in Loyola Park are at the Farwell Avenue entrance. Very nice. Well, how, what if someone would like to volunteer for the festival or other events at the park? What can someone do? The Loyola Park Advisory Council can always use more committee members. The meetings are usually had, held every third Wednesday uh, you should stop by the Loyola Park Fieldhouse and talk to Park Supervisor Mary Hopkins for the updated meeting schedule. In general, we begin planning next year's events um, for June in January of that year. And Bill, is there anything that you want to add in closing? Well, first of all, we'd like to thank everyone who participated in the 2014 Artists of the Wall Festival, Dreaming It Real. Um, with our annual painting of the wall, we have a Rogers Park tradition. We're keeping a history of our neighborhood, building friendships and recording memories. 
We would also like to thank those who had the foresight to begin this tradition 21 years ago, including Katie Hogan, Richard Kaufman, Keith Lord, and Regina Robinson. Great. Well, thank you for talking with me, Bill Morden of the Rogers Park Chamber of Commerce. This is Eve Brownstone with Brown Brownstone Therapeutics. Have a good night, everybody. Sweet dreams.